Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini National Treasures Baseball 4-Box Picker Team number 18. Big thanks to all of these awesome people here for getting into the action. Thanks for spending your Thursday night with us. It was Aaron Pettit with Last Spot Mojo. And we had some number block teams, which filled rather quickly. There they are. There you go. So those are the teams. Works just like our number block breaks, but only for that break right there. Let's, let's put this next to me right over here. All right, and there's 2020 Panini National Treasures Baseball. All right, let's slide these over here. You can see this on the top camera right there. They're not going anywhere. Did I not enough? All right, there we go. All right, first guy out of the gate is Rookie of the Year finalist Alec Baum, 92 out of 99. Going to, what's happening here? Are these regular top loaders in the, sorry. Uh, I think there's a mix up here. All right, there's, for the Phillies, that's a number block team, by the way, that goes to Phillies too. That'll be for Ray. back on track. 22 out of 99, Ozzie Smith. That'll be for the Cardinals. That's going to go to, that's a number block team as well. So St. Louis 2, that's another one for Ray Hughes. Nice. And we've got Walker Bueller. Nice. World champ. 58 out of 99. John with my Dodgers. Here is the Ryan Express, 13 out of 25. Astros edition going to David Baker, the butcher, the baker, the candlestick maker. Albert Alzale, 65 out of 99. Social signatures. Cubs, Cubs kind of, kind of rebuilding. John with the Cubbies. Out of 25, we got three-color patch and autograph, my rivals, Logan Webb. For, the, for my rivals, the Giants, Chris Miller with that one. All right, there's Brandon McKay, four out of 25. Three color patch and autograph going to Aaron Pettit and the Rays last spot mojo strikes again. How come top lures are hard to find in prison basketball? Pandemic. Heard of that? Burt Blylevin, 9 out of 25. Turns out a lot of those are made in uh, turns out a lot of those made in China. 
For Minnesota, that goes to Victor. So a supply chain issue. We got cut signature materials to 15. The Man of Steel, Rick Henderson. There it is, Man of Steel. I, I, I am the greatest, greatest, greatest of all time, time, time. That goes to... Three more slider boxes here. At least it wasn't an autograph, Rex. Uh, that goes to the A's, Al Alfonso, with that one. Put, put some filler cards in here so it doesn't rattle around. That was box one. I think Lonnie might be lagging behind. Someone tell Lonnie he's lagging behind a few hours. Lonnie, that, that giveaway, that mixer is done. Mixer giveaway all done. All the videos are uploaded. What's up, Chris? 97 out of 99. Oh, oh, oh. The filler. You're talking about the filler break. That doesn't fill the mixer, I don't think, but we can do that tonight. I think we still have to do one more. But yeah, I'll, I'll run that randomizer. Carlos Martinez, 71 out of 99 jersey. St. Louis 1, that would be for Jason S. Thirty-three out of ninety-nine game gear, George Springer. Did I say hi to Chris Murphy? Hi, Chris Murphy. George Springer. That'll be for David Baker and the Strohs. And Rex saying, sign, re-sign Kyle Schwarber because he's not going to get that much money elsewhere. I think you're right. I don't know. Someone I feel like would... I feel like a, an AL team would grab him as a DH from whatever side he hits better at. There's Frankie Frisch, 11 out of 25, old school Cardinal going to St. Louis 1. That's Jason again. And look at this, AL Rookie of the Year, 94 out of 99, Kyle Lewis. And that'll be for Aaron Pettit and the M's. And here is fake Mike Trout. 70 out of 75. That goes to the Angels number block. And that'll be Angels zero. It'll also be for Aaron Pettit. Two color patch and autograph. 30 out of 49. Willie Castro for the Tigers. I could see Schwarber, Schwarber and Contreras on the Yankees, Rex is saying. I could see Schwarber on the Yankees. If they want to get like a kind of a big bat in the line, they could just get at DH. Although his fielding has improved over the years. Chris Parent with that. There's got to be a market for, for Kyle Schwarber, no? He didn't strike out as much. Maybe a slightly better average. 30 out of 99, Alex Bregman. Going to the Astros, David Baker. And a dual signature materials. Wow, 32 out of 99. Do they both have the same? No, two different people. I'm gonna have to make one person happy and one person sad. There's Aristides Aquino and Jordan Alvarez. Dual relic and dual on book autograph. So Rick T, Rick Thomas has the Reds and David Baker 
has the uh, David Baker has the uh, Astros. So one person happy, one person sad. Neighborhood. I don't think that in, I don't, that basketball mixer is not going to happen tonight. I'm afraid we still have to do a few more fillers. I'll do the. I'll run the filler pack. But we still have a few more to go on that. And it'd be too late to do it anyway. Per the schedule. Like there's another card in there. There is. That was weird. Oh, there's like a little bit of glue right there that had that card stuck there. All right. I think I see a printing plate in there too. Evan White, 18 out of 99. That'll be for the M's. That'll be for Aaron Pettit. We got Zach Collins, 20, uh, 74 out of 99. Colossal relic for the White Sox. White Sox are a number block team. Chicago White Sox for Mark Nation. Four out of 10, Juan Soto. Nice two color dual relic game gear materials for the Nationals. Nationals for Mark Nation. Two out of 50, Larry Walker. Piece of his jersey going to Colorado, Matthew Bodner. And the plate, that's a nice uh, Mets patch. It's Robert Gesellman. Colossal relic and autograph. One of one for the Mets, Jimmy Brandt with the Metropolitans. There you go. As you know, out of fives and under, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. We've got the Punisher. That's what it says. I received these Aquino, 65 out of 99. So that'll be for Rick Thomas. This one's all for you. You got a chance at a second one over there, though. But at least I got you covered with this one. We've got another nice patch coming up. That's Nick Solak for the Rangers. 79 out of 99, Texas. Jeffrey S. with the Rangers. Another one for the Rangers. Wow. Adrian Beltre. Treasured material, piece of his lumber, and his excellent on-card autograph, 17 out of 26. Another one for Jeffrey. He's first ballot Hall of Fame, right? Beltre? And 5 out of 99, we've got Yu Chang. Nice on-book autograph. Big piece of his jersey right there. And that'll be for the Tribe Eastwood with the Indians. I hope you find a, a slider box for that, Roger. All right, and the final box. Good luck. Rex was saying, love Shore, but it just hasn't had the great years that were expected. Yeah, I remember when he was coming up the ranks. I think, I think we were all like, yeah, that's, I mean, can you imagine just like a, a big lumbering hitting catcher, you know, very old school guy. Ooh, we got a, we got a fatty here, a fat bottom boxes make the rocking world go around. 
Let's see what we got. Will it all is it a monster book? Just extra hits? Do I how, how many people do I have to make happy or sad? No, it looks I see three names on there, so it's it's a big fat triple. All right, good luck. Ooh, we got Jason Dominguez, thirteen out of twenty-five. Bronx Bombers, number block. Yankees three, David Larson. And if this guy turns out to be even half as good as how big his hype is, he's going to be awesome. Six out of 25, Jack Flaherty. Game gear. Piece of the lumber in there as well. He's an NL guy. That'll be Cardinals six. That's going to be for Nick Stober. Keep running out of supplies. Ill prepared for this break. Sorry, folks. All right. We got Tatis Jr., 37 out of 99. Do I think the Dominguez being on the Yankees is the reason he has all this hype? Yeah, <laughs> Ron's right. I mean, that much hype, that level of hype. I think, I think scouts. There's nice to tease, by the way, going to Alex. I think scouts think he's going to be good. I don't think that's a question. I think he's been rated like one of the top international prospects. So there's that hype already. But that next level of uh, of hype is the fact that he's. That he's in the Yankees organization. There's Cal Ripken, 39 out of 49. Matt Medlin with the O's. So with how how large and rabid of a fan base the Yankees are, if uh, if you get in early on the Dominguez market and he becomes a Yankee, has a great debut, has a great season, has a great career, so on and so forth, every year that, that card is going up in value. Six out of seven, Paul DeYoung, jersey and autograph. It's kind of the kind of the Yankee effect. I mean, imagine if like there's Paul DeYoung. Uh, by the way, six for Nick Stover. Imagine if like Wander Franco was. Uh, if imagine if Wander Franco was on the Yankees. There's Bobby Bradley, the assassin. Seven out of nine. I don't think I've ever heard anyone call him the assassin, but that's what they say, Eastwood. Eastwood with the Indians. Wander Franco is like one of the top prospects in baseball. And no offense against the Rays, but since he's on the Rays, he kind of goes under the radar. Because on the Yankees. Ooh, a one of one. It's a one of one. Brian Abreu. Big piece of the Astros logo right there. Pretty nice for uh, David Baker and Houston. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. What do we have here? White Sox? Wow. Luis Robert. 59 out of 99. I feel like that's a rare on-card auto. White Sox are a number block team. And that's going to go to 59 out of 99. Aaron Pettit got randomized number nine. Wow. That's nice. All right. And we've got 12 out of 49 triple legend trios. 12 out of 49 triple legend trios. First legend. Wow. Jimmy Fox. 
Philadelphia A's. Mel Ott, New York baseball giants. And Paul Wehner for the Pittsburgh Pirates. That is awesome. It's out of 49. I thought the number would be a lot lower, but three legends right there. Nice triple relics here. I mean, think about those pieces of Paul Wehner's lumber right there. All right, now, time to make some people happy, some people sad. Good luck. Let's flip over here. Let's do the triple first. All right, so A's, Giants, Pirates, and then the duel is uh, Cincinnati Reds and Jordan Alvarez, Houston Astros. One dice roll for both lists. Good luck. Five and a three, eight times. Triple first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good luck. Eighth and final time. After eight goes to Jimmy Fox and the A's, Alfonso with the Oakland A's. The old Phil Jimmy Fox was an old Philadelphia athletic, if you remember your baseball history. Where you, there, there's Jimmy Fox right there. So he was an old Philadelphia athletic. Goes to uh, goes to Oakland. So and apologies to the Pirates and Giants. But congrats again to Alfonso with the A's with the Jimmy Fox. Jimmy Fox trivia. If you uh, if you know and love the movie uh, A League of Their Own, which I'm a big fan of, the Jimmy Tom Hanks is Jimmy Dugan character, based off of Jimmy Fox. Five and a three, eight times for the duel. Good luck on this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight, it's Cincinnati on top. Rick Thomas with the Reds. Wow, what a break for him. Gets the Aristides Aquino and the Jordan Alvarez dual relic, dual on card autograph. Very nice. Although I think the both the Astros and the Car uh, Reds had a pretty good break, though, individually. So that's how it works sometimes. But there you go, Rick. Congrats to you. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was Pick Your Team 18 of 2020 Panini National Treasures Baseball. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.